Hello friends. Today we will discuss about regular expressions in MySQL. Basically regular expressions are used to match specific pattern in any data. Fine. So before moving towards uh, regular expression queries, we will first go through various uh, notations in that is going to be used in regular expression. So the very first is a caret symbol which is going to use or which is being used to identify uh, that this particular specific pattern starts with. Fine. Then we have uh, a dollar sign. That dollar sign is going to be used when we want to find something which is ending with a specific uh, string. Fine. Then the another thing is if we want to find out uh, uh, any character specific character uh, or a set of characters then in that particular case we can use square brackets in that we'll provide we can provide uh, a specific number of characters we can provide a specific range of characters too fine suppose uh, uh, if i want to provide uh, or if i want to fetch some data that that contains a b and c then in that particular case i need to provide three attributes fine we'll see the examples later then we have uh, or symbol that or symbol is going to uh, use for finding uh, some patterns which contains two different type of uh, two different type of set of characters then we have uh, uh, the dot symbol dot dot symbol is going to represent instance of a character that instance of character is going to represent uh, a, a single character suppose i want to uh, if i want to go find out multiple number of characters then i then i have to put that many instances of uh, the dot and then uh, we'll see the then we will see how we can search specific length of string by providing the number of length into the string fine so uh, let us move towards the queries so the very first that we are going to uh, check is uh, the 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 very first that we are going to check is the character or a string uh, starts with a specific character fine so here I'm having one table, employee table, and in that particular table, I'm having employee's first name and employee's last name. And from that, I want to find out uh, the employee's first name, fine? So how can we, how can we identify that? So uh, the query for that will be like select, then star, or you can write any name, any, any column name over here from employee where uh, where now I need to put my regular expression over here fine say like I want to compare with ENP first name so it will be like ENP first name REG EXP that is the syntax for the regular the, that is the keyword for regular expression and then I have to provide the pattern fine so in single inverted comma I'm going to provide a pattern like carrot uh, say name starts with a fine so this one is going to find out the name that is going to be that is going to start with a fine let us see the result of this so here we got the result where the name starts with a fine now suppose I want to find out the name that end with A. So here I got uh, the list of employees whose first name ends with A. Fine. Now in place of this, suppose I want to find out uh, that the employee first name starts with uh, capital A, capital D, and capital B, for example, A, D, and B. Fine. Now let us see the result. 
unfortunately there is no uh, uh, employee first name that starts with b and b let me take some another one let's say s and uh, m fine okay so i got the result so here we can see here we got the result uh, that contains employees first name starts with uh, s a and m fine so this way we can put uh, a specific uh, number of characters to compare even we can put the range of the characters also that can be like a to uh, say n fine So here I got all the names which uh, which starts with uh, A to N uh, characters. Fine. So this way we can uh, find out specific type, specific uh, pattern uh, using regular expressions in MySQL. Fine. Now uh, even I can also use uh, the OR state OR over here. Fine. So uh, the or will be used like this or it can be say it starts with a to n or over here I'm going to provide one more thing like uh, n to z and that is going to end with fine okay let's see the result of this. See, it starts with A to N or it, it is going to end with uh, N to Z. Fine. So, this way you can also apply uh, the OR function. Over here, OR function is normally used when uh, we are having uh, specific patterns in uh, regular expressions. Over here, we don't have such data uh, which can represent that the use of or function will be like this fine now if you want to find out specific character that appears in the string that appears in the string in the string at any place it can appear fine suppose i am going to write say g g should appear anywhere in the string i want that kind of string fine so let's click on the go button what result we get so here we got only one result which contains g in between any uh, there is no other data which contains g fine let me write uh, say d fine so now suppose let me write specific pattern over here like uh, d g d for example so it will find this particular gd pattern throughout the string fine so there is only one now suppose i'm going to write say ad so only there is there is only one uh, uh, string which contains ad fine so this way we can uh, we can find specific string specific uh, uh, substring in the string fine now let us talk about various uh, instance of uh, characters fine suppose i want a string having uh, the length 12 so what i can do is i have to put the start symbol then i have to put end symbol and in between that suppose i want the string having length 5 fine so i need to put five instances of that dot I need to put five instances of that dot fine so let us see the result of this so here I got the list of the name which which is having uh, five characters fine let me add one more okay so here we got the result which contains six characters fine now in place of this we can also put in place of this we can also put the number of characters fine suppose i want in now in in curly bracket i can put the number so how can uh, i do that say simply dot and then the number of 
instances of that particular say i'm going to put 4 fine so 4a 4 dot sorry fine so let us see the result so here the length is 4 we can see fine now suppose if i'm going to write 5 over here this will generate the result with 5 i'm going to write uh, say 7 over here so it will it will create 7 instances of the dot that character specially fine so here we got the list of uh, characters which contains uh, list of employee name which which is having 7 uh, characters in the name fine so this is a very basic use of regular expressions in mysql in next video, we will discuss about some complex operations with regular expression. Thank you for watching the video and please don't forget to subscribe the channel. Thank you very much again.